slept in the van last night. We're still about two hours from uh, from McCarthy, right? <laughs> McCarthy, yeah. I haven't had my coffee yet, and I don't know where I am, so that's that also is helpful. Uh, breakfast this morning, Cliff Bar. This is actually the best one. The blueberry almond butter. Just started the dirt road section. There's people camped out as well. Right there, right there. I don't know if you can see this. But down through the river, there's a bunch of people fishing. And well, that's the Copper River. And that's where some of the best reds in the world are from. World. In the world. Okay. Right, Luke? All right. We're gonna get on the road and hike in. Hike in, finally. About time. <laughs> So I'm doing my first taste test for Alaskan water. That's smooth. It's really good. It gives Washington a run for its money for sure. It's good to be here. Update. We just got to McCarthy, parked the car. Beautiful day. It's gotta be like at least 75 out here right now. Pack's almost ready to go. Just gotta get a few more things and we'll hit the trail. I'm gonna head up to Kennecott and Root, Root Glacier. So we're taking a shuttle up to the glacier and then we'll be hiking across the glacier. So that's something I have never done in my life and that's a good thing, thanks to Luke's expertise. I'm with the professional right here. Certified. Look at this, it's a f***ing disaster. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of a disaster in here. Just a happy disaster. Nobody better make fun of my van. Nobody's gonna make fun of your van, bro. Good. You got this for $1,100. You can't hate on, this van got us 60 miles on a dirt road. Don't hate on the Dodge Caravan. All right. We're gonna get going. Wanna shake the ground? Wanna break away? Let loose. I'm tired of waiting. Gotta make that move. All the neon signs. Now they shout to me and you to write our story. Wanna shape the new. Just made it to the edge of Root Glacier. Heading up to that big mountain right there. Donahoe Peak. <laughs> Donahoe Peak. Um, our campsite for the night is gonna be somewhere in that saddle, uh, just to the left of Donahoe Peak. There's campsites all around this area. I mean, even for the slightly adventurous type, you could get out here for maybe a mile hiking. Not even that, I don't know, it was really short. And have a absolutely stupendous view. That's great. And we ain't got nothing, gotta do something, get it right. Gonna keep on running, grab the fun and live it live. And tomorrow's far away, should I let the party be? And we ain't got nothing, gotta do something. Let us fall tonight. Sent it too hard down the side of the moraine and it's rain. So, side note, respect the moraine. Just because it doesn't look like ice. Doesn't mean it. Doesn't mean it isn't. 
So I decided to put my crampons, which are Gribble G10s. After I slipped, I felt a little bit uh, less comfortable with walking just with my boots. But I also just wanted to test these out to see how they worked. And so far, they're great. They're stiff, which I'm sure is great if you have mountaineering boots, but I'm just using regular hiking boots. And it's like it kind of wants to pull my foot out of my boot. Almost across the glacier, it took pretty long. I mean, we weren't we were really hurrying, but I need to look back on the map. I think that was about a mile and a half. And now we're just getting to the other side. Really cool little waterfall right here. And we're gonna have to figure out how to get down and then climb up the side of it where we're gonna camp tonight. I think we found the portal to the center of the earth. Right down this creek. Ah, well, this is the glacier that we were just on. Hey, and this is so incredible. So we just went into the ice caves. Cue my iPhone footage from that. And it was a lot of fun. It was a good time. A little bit, it was weird because this creek right here is coming from the lake up top and it's super warm. And once you get down inside there, it was it was foggy within the first 50 feet. Pretty insane. Now it's time to head up to the lake. See what that's all about. It's gonna be a good night.